come together uh, and to learn uh, how to be together, to be in community uh, with each other. For me, it was very touching that to be able to see that. And that's why I asked, can we introduce ourselves so that we can see who's in the room so I know I need to run up to this brother or over to this sister. I feel a sense of togetherness or, you know, being with somebody that's like me. And uh, around here in Humboldt County, it's pretty far in between, far and few between when I see a lot of black men together. A lot of people here, they get <clears throat> scared of, frightful of seeing more than two black guys together, you know what I mean? It made me feel kind of just nice. Like, I, I feel fed, I feel energized. Like, I, whenever I go out, like, and I go into white spaces, I feel very overwhelmed. I feel like I always have to step out. I feel like I'm always submitting or putting on a face. And I don't feel that way here. <laughs> so, I feel human. We had a black town hall meeting. My wife and I, we were sick, we, were, we said enough is enough. We said, hey, we're not putting up with this no more. There's all these killings, it's getting crazy. So we called a black town hall meeting, July 18, 2016. You wouldn't believe the response that we had um, at the Better, Bu Better Business Bureau downtown. The sisters overwhelmed. The sisters overwhelmed the place. I mean, they have, they, they, we were out credential. When I say we, brothers, I know there's a few and far between, and they were out credential. They were saying all, they were speaking some very good points. And that, that, that's when the ideal came to me. Us brothers got to get together. I feel energized. I loved it. <laughs> There's so much power in that room, and I think in love and intelligence. Um, I just feel encouraged.